In this Binance Unlimited P2P trading video tutorial, I'm going to show you step by step how you can make from as low as 20,000 Naira per day, okay, to as high as 500k per day doing this repeatedly, all right? So basically, um, the whole summary of this video um, uh, is that we'll buy USDT in one country and then we'll sell in another country and I have an app okay that can allow you to receive money within minutes okay with zero fee that is all I'm going to be sharing with you in this video so if you are new to the channel and you love videos about making money online about crypto trade investing then consider subscribing okay hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time videos like this are published on this channel and if you do gain value from this video give it a thumbs up all right give it a thumbs up and don't forget to share it with others all right and if you want to learn more if you want to interact with me um to join my crypto community just use the link in the video description to join the telegram group okay now to be able to implement this uh, arbitrage trading this p2p arbitrage trading i'm going to show you you need an account with binance okay you need an account with the binance exchange you can use the link in the video description to download the app if you don't have one already all right and then you need an account with um, this app called Bata. Okay, Bata is an app by Fluta Waves that allows you to send money, okay, across borders, all right? And the beautiful thing is that you can send and receive this money with zero fee, all right? I'll show you how to use that. So basically, the two apps we need right here is Binance app, okay? Though I'm going to be demonstrating this using my desktop, okay, using the web version of the Binance Exchange, but you can do this on the app. So you need an account with Binance and then you need an account with uh, Bata, all right? For Bata, I will leave the link and then the uh, referral code that you're going to use to sign up is free of charge, okay? Uh, I will leave a link and the referral code in the video description as well, okay? And then for Binance, you just use the link in the video description to, to, to sign up for an account. Now, once you get your accounts ready for these two platform, all we need to do is to go to Binance P2P. And how do we access Binance P2P? You come in here to where it says buy crypto and then go to P2P trading, okay? And that will bring you here. And by default, you see here that the fiat is, um, the fiat currency is in my local currency, which is Nigeria. So we'll buy the way this work is that we'll buy USDT using our Nigerian Naira, okay? We'll buy from any of this person using our Nigerian Naira. And then we'll go to Kenya and sell the same USDT that we've purchased on the Binance um, exchange, all right? We'll sell them in, in Kenya and then we'll come back um, and send back the money to Nigeria, okay? And then we would have made profit. It is as simple as that. Now, for this to work for you, you need to have an agent in Kenya, Okay, you need to have someone, either a brother, a sister, a partner, all right, in Kenya. And the way it works is very simple. If we are going to be leveraging on using the Bata app, okay, it is very simple. You will have a Binance account, okay, you who is going to do this business will have a Binance account. Your colleague or your agent or your partner in, um, in Kenya will equally need to have a Binance account, okay. You will have a, this um, Bata app on your phone and then your colleague, your partner or your agent in Kenya will equally have this app on his or her phone. All right. So what it, oh, the, the, the simple way is that when I buy USDT in Nigeria, OK, I can send the USDT with zero fee. All right. Because it is now Binance to Binance. I can send it with zero fee to my colleague or my business partner or my agent in Kenya okay the person in kenya will sell the usdt in his or her own kenyan um uh, currency okay so when they sell in their kenyan ceilings all they need to do is send back that money to you via the butter app all right so when you receive it from your butter app from here directly it goes into it is you know settled into your bank account then you can repeat the process again and again okay you can repeat that process again and again so first let me just go ahead and demonstrate this we'll come in here to binance p2p once again to assess binance p2p you go to buy crypto go to 
P2P trading, okay? Once you come to P2P trading, these are what people are ready to sell. Right now, this person is ready to sell one USDT for 774 Naira, 30 Kobo, okay? And then this person have, um, the available USDT, this person have now is 30 USDT, meaning that the person cannot sell. The limit is from 5,000 to around 23,000, okay? Uh, this person cannot sell more than, let's say we are going to be buying 100,000, 200,000, 300,000, or 500 we cannot buy from this person okay the same thing happens to the next person this person is from um four thousand okay to six thousand so we can't buy from this person the next person is from twenty thousand okay to fifty thousand we cannot equally buy from this person all right so um to take out the issue of uh, beginning to look for who um you know scrolling down and start looking for who will sell from 300 and above okay all you just need to do is to come in here to where it says um, amount here where it says amount okay um let's say i want to buy um usdt worth 300k okay so i can go ahead and put in my 300k here and then click on search and that will sort out everybody in the market who is ready to sell from that limit upward okay and give um and make the person available to you then you can go ahead and buy all right but if I scroll down I, a little here, you see that this is a verified mission. As you can see, this is the bash showing that this person is verified. And that this person is se selling from, you know, 300 to around 300, okay? And then the next person is selling from 200 to around 200, all right? And then this person is selling from 4,000. So the next, we we'll just go ahead and use the filter here and put in 300 because I want to use 300 to demonstrate this. So if I go ahead and put in 300,000 um, Naira here. So once I put in 300, I'll go ahead and click on search. All right. So here we have them. Um, this is from 100 to about 400. Okay. This person is ready to sell at 775. All right. And then from 100 to around 400. Okay. So the next thing we need to do is to click on buy USDT. So I just go ahead and click on buy USDT. Now when I click on buy USDT, we are going to be buying USDT worth 300k. So I'll go ahead and put here where it says I want to pay 300. So I will just put in 300 the amount I want to pay. Okay. And then um, I will let know that if I pay 300, if I pay 300k, I'm going to receive 338, 37, sorry, 387 USDT. This is what I'm going to be receiving. Okay. This is what I'm going to be receiving. And it is this USDT that we're going to send to our colleague or our agent or our partner in Kenya. Okay. So take note of this. We are going to be sending 387 USDT to our partner. Okay. So I'll just go ahead and copy this. All right. So once you copy this, the next thing you want to do is to send this USDT to your partner in Kenya. Now, because the person has a Binance account as well, you are not going to be paying any fee in sending this. OK, so we can either send it to the email the person used to open the Binance account or to the phone number the person used to open the Binance account or we send it to the person's uh, Binance Pay user ID. All right or Binance PID. Okay. So to do that, all we need to do is to go to wallet. All right. So once I hover over wallet, you want to come in here to where it says funding wallet. Funding wallet is where you have the USDT that we just purchased now. Okay. All of the USDT you purchased now will be in your funding wallet. So I'll just go ahead and click on that. Let it load up. All right, so the, we are in the funding wallet. So once it loads up, okay, you will see where it says pay. All right. So this pay here is what uh, we are going to be using to send the crypto we are sending. And we can do this with zero fee. Okay, you don't need to pay any fee. So I click on, you know, the Binance pay. Now, if you click on it and you don't have an account already with the Binance pay, it will ask you to create an account. All right. It will ask you to create an account. And then when you create an account, it will generate an ID for you, okay? So it will generate an ID for you, meaning that with this buy pay ID, you can use it to receive money. Whenever somebody sends money to this pay ID, you will receive it. Okay, when they send to your email, you will receive it. When they send to your phone number, you will receive it. 
all right so once you are here you want to go ahead and click on send okay so once i click on send you see that we can send to the person's email address to the person's phone number okay to the person's PID, that is if the person has created a Binance Pay account already, okay, uh, then we can send to the bi person Binance ID as well, all right? So you can send to any of these and the person will receive the money, all right? In as much as that person is a Binance user, just send it and the person will receive the money. So let's assume we are going to send via email, okay? All we need to do is to type in that person's email here. All right once we type in the email here just click on continue and when you continue to ask you to select the uh, currency you want to send and then how much you want to send just specify all of that and send to the person now you are doing this with zero fee you're not paying any fee when you do um with the binance pay when you send crypto to a binance user using the binance pay okay so now we have succeeded in sending our crypto to our partner or our agent in Kenya all right so the next thing we need to do now is to sell that USDT in Kenya and then send back the money to us um, as Naira okay so to do that we'll go back to the P2P again go back to buy crypto go to P2P trading all right so once this load up now this is showing NGN because I'm in Nigeria okay when the person in Kenya who is transacting this business open Binance P2P okay it will be showing here the, the Kenya local currency Okay, but let me just show you what is possible because from here we can actually do this transaction. All right, so if I come in here and click on this, I'll go ahead and type in the Kenya symbol, the currency symbol, which is the KES. Okay, so I'll go ahead and type in and select that. All right, so now when this loads up, the next thing we want to do is to switch from the buy tab, okay, to the sell tab because we are selling, we already have USDT, we just want to sell. All right, so I'll go ahead and click on the sell tab. This is what the other person over there will be doing for you, all right? Except you want to be doing it yourself. Now, when we switch to the sell tab, here you have different payment methods, okay? You have different payment methods. I think the most popular is this mobile top-up, all right? But they can do bank transfer and the rest. Uh, whoever you are contacting, whatever it is, whether they are sending via mobile top-up or whatever, it is still um you know acceptable because you can still send via mobile top up to, um, on the beta um app all right to anybody um back to nigeria okay so you see here all right and then you have transfer if i want to specifically use bank transfer all i need to do is to come to where it says payment okay where it says all payment method so i'll go ahead and click on the arrow here and then select uh, bank transfer for instance okay if i select bank transfer it will sort out all those okay you see here now that we now have bank transfer okay we have bank transfer all of these um multiple payment methods okay so we can sell to these persons all right and the beautiful thing here is that some of these persons are missions okay so always make sure that you're dealing with missions so that your transaction will easily go through um without you getting cancelled orders and the rest so to make sure that you are only dealing with missions make sure that you click on this filter all right so once you click on it you go ahead and check where it says only show merchant ads okay check that on so once you check this on um it will only show you ads from merchants okay from verified merchants on the binance exchange all right so these are the only people you'll be selling your usdt to or buying your usdt from all right and then if you are doing for only merchant you see that the volume of the usdt okay that they are ready to buy equally increases because if you do randomly you you know get these people who are ready to sell like two three usdt and the rest so from the merchant it is okay all right and then another thing you can do here is if you don't get the person who wants to buy the amount you are ready to sell all you just need to do is to type in that amount here okay and then click on search and then binance will sort um search for the um anybody selling within that range okay and make the person available to you all right so let's just go back with the all payment methods okay or let me just go with this uh, with this let's say we want to sell to this first person here okay so all your colleague or your partner needs to do is to come in here to sell after you know using the filter and sorting this out is to just to come in here and click on sell okay once the person comes in here and click on sell remember the number of usdt we bought remember right 
so i think i still have that is 387 usdt all right so if i slot that in here um we are going to be receiving 48,303 shillings okay um kenya shillings okay this is what we are going to be receiving for in the kenyan currency this is what the person selling for you will be receiving all right now this complaint you are seeing here is that this person is ready to buy from 50,000 um, kenyan shillings upward all right um because we sorted this uh, this is um from a verified mission okay this person is ready to buy from you know 50,000 and above but the whole idea is that if we are selling this okay if we are selling this to this um, person or to anybody who will buy it we are going to be getting 48,000 Kenyan shillings okay uh, let's look for somebody who is ready to buy from 48,000 and see okay all right I, I think we can sell to this person here so just sell to this person and then the amount we okay okay so now you see that that complaint has gone off so we are going to be doing this okay um via the we are, this is what we are going to be receiving and this is what we are going to make our calculation on all right now if you are someone who have an account in kenya and you don't want to have an agent in kenya you just want to do all of this on your own all you need to do is you know add your payment method here all right add your payment if you have the kenya um, bank okay you can add up that bank here all right if i click on this arrow it tells you to set your payment method okay so you can set your payment method and if you have any of this this payment means of payment okay you can just add it up to binance all right and then the person sends the money directly to that account then you receive it from wherever you are okay so now the next thing we need to do is to go to Bata and know how much this is okay remember that it cost us 300k to buy this usdt let us see how much we are making in this transaction alone so let me open up my butter app so here we are on the app when you open up the butter app okay this is what it looks like now if you don't have a butter account already you can use the code that is displayed on the screen right now okay um to sign off on account because you need to go to play store when you download the app from play store all right it will ask you to sign up and then when it asks you to sign up it there will be a colon for you to add your details and then beneath will be where to add your your referral code okay so the referral code that is displayed on the screen i will probably leave this in the video description so all you just need to do is to copy it all right and add it up to the where it says referral code just click and add up that there all right and sign up for an account now when you log in this is what it looks like okay you can request to receive money you can send money you can pay bills okay you can buy air times all right and then you can add money to your butter account and so on so I'll go ahead and click on the send money option so that we know how much the 48,000 Kenyan shillings will give us, okay, which is equivalent to 300,000 that we initially sent via USDT, okay. So I'll click on the send money. All right, so once I click on send money, it brings us here, okay. So we have the option to send money to bank account. The same thing you're seeing here is the same interface the person in Kenya will be seeing, okay so yeah we have to send money we have the option to send to bank account or to send to mobile uh, money okay whatever you use the person will still receive it all right so i'll go ahead and click on send to bank account all right so once i send to click on send to bank account you have the option to send it to a local bank account or to international so in this case we are going to use international all right so click on international once you click on international the next thing now because i'm in nigeria it will be from nigeria to okay any other country that i select here all right so from kenya the person will now be sending from kenya to nigeria and so on okay and the beautiful thing is that you'll be doing all of this with zero fee okay so i'll go ahead and select click here to select kenya you see here that we have the kenya shillings okay so make sure that you select that because it's kenya we are dealing with all right and then the next thing is to add this amount all right this amount that we uh, we are selling our usdt for so our 387 usdt is worth 48,285 kenyan shillings okay so i'll go ahead and type that in here 48,285 okay then six zero all right so that is what we are going to add up here all right and then you see at this point in time what this is okay is giving us is around so what we'll be receiving and here you see that 
um butter is telling you that this arrives in minutes okay you are going to receive the money like almost instantly all right so the person sends the money in kenyan shillings and you are receiving the money in naira and the conversion is done automatically for you okay they send the money in kenyan shillings you receive it in naira if you send in naira the person receives it in their own local currency okay so you can try this out with any other country of your choice but this is the one that i've tested out that is working right now and that is why i'm sharing this with you okay so in this transaction alone you are making um this is 311k okay so it means that in this transaction alone you are making 11k cool in this transaction alone that is um after you've carried out this transaction okay and then you can rinse and repeat this process again and again okay you can rinse and, re and, re and repeat this process again and again let's say we try this with 500k or with 500 dollars now if i come back here to the exchange and put in let's say we were we were able to send 500 dollars to kenya right okay so if we're able to send 500 dollar it means that the 500 dollars sold in kenya is now 62,000 um, um, uh, kenyan shillings okay so if i go back here and change this from what it is and then put in 62,000 okay 370 okay 370 kenyan shillings okay so 300 and Kenyan shillings, this will now give you around 402,000 um, Naira. Okay, 402,000 Naira. Now, how much would have cost us, okay, in Naira to buy 500 USD? Let's find that. Okay, so the next thing we need to do is to change from the Kenyan shillings to go to NGN. So I'll just type in NGN here. Okay, type in NGN here to, to change from the Naira to, from the Kenyan shillings to the Naira. Okay. So let it load up. All right. So once it loads up, we come to the buy. Now we want to know how much it would have cost us to buy the 500 USDT that is now giving us this 400K. Okay. So let's say we are buying from this person. All right. So we we'll go ahead and click on buy. Now when I click on buy, I want to put in 500 because 500 is what gave us this um, 400 plus. Okay. So I put in 500 USDT here. Now it would have cost us um, to buy 500 USDT. It would have cost us 387,000. Okay, approximately 388,000 naira. Okay, 388,000 naira is what it would have cost us. And then we are selling this in Kenya and receiving back 402,000 naira. So when you deduct this, okay, from whatsoever you bought here, all right. So whatsoever you get is what becomes your interest. All right. I'm just demonstrating this step by step. Now, when you do this with a larger capital, how much can you be making? All right. Let's say you are doing this with a million naira, with two million naira, with three million naira. Okay. The 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 the, the profit you make is not limited to, let's say, just hundred or two hundred thousand. Okay. So it is unlimited. You can do this again and again. You can do it, uh, depending on how you know free or the person you are dealing this with. Okay. Is you can do it like time with that number. You can do it two times, three times a day, four times a day. And at the end of the day, if each profit you are making is 20K, 30K, 40K per transaction, you can now add up everything and know what you're making for that day. Okay. So let's say you do this with a millionaire and then your, your profit is like 50K or 30K. And then your target is to make 100K every day. It means that you would have repeated that process either two times or three times a day. Okay. And then you relax for that day. The next day you continue again. You can use this system to make cool money for yourself. But remember that you need to have someone in Kenya to make this easy for you. All right. There are apps that allows you to do this. Okay. One of the app. Um, if I come back to, to the payment method here. Okay. Uh, one of these app like this one you are looking at right now. Okay. This is equally available in Kenya. But um, my experience with this app is something not, um, it, it is not something I can recommend, okay? So I prefer to use Bata, have somebody in Kenya that would do this for me, then use Bata to receive the money. This is all I have to share with you. This video is, um, you know, I, I believe the duration of the video is long, but it is worth it. I just have to share this with you. I hope the video is helpful. If you do like the video, give it a thumbs up and um, go use this system to make money for yourself. And I will see you guys in the next video.